I use Origin because it's a relatively inexpensive and convenient way to collect DNA. And uh, since we get samples from all over the world, it's easy to do in rather remote places and without refrigeration. I use Origin because it's really easy to take into the field. So we do work in Africa and the chemicals are completely stable while we're there and it's very easy to get samples and then people understand exactly how to fill, you know, how to spit just to this line. <laughs> I use Origin uh, because we collect a lot of different uh, samples from children and often they don't want to give blood samples so uh, it's much easier for them to spit into a pot um, when they're scared. Um, and also we carry out projects in lots of different countries and um, it's much easier for our collectors to send the samples back to us in the post um, when we use Origin kits rather than trying to mess around with blood tubes. I use your Origin because it's a very effective and easy way to collect samples. Well, there aren't any alternatives. Blood, trying to take blood has become prohibitively expensive and Origin is quick and easy and I find it very reliable. We uh, use the Origin product, which we have been for the last five years or so, because it's increased our ability to collect biologic samples from persons who have cognitive impairment. I use Origin because we think that it's the better the alternative, the better choice for pick up a very good quality and quantity of DNA from saliva and the quality for different tests for genome-wide association studies or or some diagnostic tests, I think that it's a better option that we have in the market. Uh, we use Origin because we are collecting samples in a pediatric hospital in Guatemala, and uh, it's very difficult to get blood from young patients. Uh, with the Origin kit, we get almost 100% of the kids to cooperate. And then what's been very important, they don't have a lot of storage facilities there. So we have stored samples there at room temperature now for almost 10 years. And we have gone back and extracted DNA salivas that we collected five years ago. And uh, actually the yield seems to go up a little.